ceramic. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm finally back with another video. Thank you for you guys that have been subscribed and that subscribed, subscribed and for sticking with me. And if you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe so you will know when I put up new makeup videos. Um, also hit that bell symbol so it will literally tell you when I have uploaded another video. So I did this um, eyeshadow like halo effect um, and I paired it with a nude lip so I like how this came out of course I'm glowing too it's just for my light um, so I hope you guys enjoy this look I'm talking through everything that I'm doing what I'm using why I'm using it um, so I hope you guys try it also comment below thumbs up if you liked it and let me know your thoughts. I love reading comments. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so the brows are done. Um, I have a brow video. If you want to see how I do my brows, um, I'll have that linked below. So I have my brows done and I'm going to prime my eyes. I'm going to use two things. I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Take the Day Off Fergie not take the day off take the day on eyeshadow primer um, it's the wet n wild brand by Fergie the Fergie line and then the NYX eyeshadow base in white and then some of the eyeshadow base I'm just gonna use a flat brush get some And I'm going to keep this more just towards the center of where that highlight color is going to be. You could do this now or you could do this a little bit later on. But I'm just going to do it now. I might reapply it and you'll see what I mean um, once I get started laying some colors down. So I'm using the Morphe 5 and it's not perfect, it's okay. I'm using the Morphe 350 palette that everybody has and everybody has used in tutorials, but I'm just now discovering why this palette is so bomb. So I am using a combination of shades, but the first color we go out. The first color I'm going to be using is this one in my crease and I'm going to use a crease brush. Um, this brush that I'm using is by Crown Brushes. Um, it doesn't have any names or number on it, but a brush that looks like, looks like this. And I'm just going to go in my crease in the outer corner and the inner corner and just buff that color. In. and I'm going to kind of have my eye open because I have hooded eyes so sometimes when I have color on the lid my eyes are all the way open very little shows or none at all so when you do your makeup with your eyes open you can really tell how your look is going to look um, like with your eyes open because nobody walks around with their eyes closed all day <laughs> so that's why I kind of do that. I have my eyes slightly open so I can see if I need to bring the color higher or whatever it is I need to do. Next, I'm going to go in with a combination of these colors and I'm going to slowly um, work them in like the inner corners and the outer corner to really give that round eye shape look actually I, I lied I'm gonna go in with an even more defined brush I'm gonna go in with a smaller brush like this to put that color in let me focus back I'm gonna put the color 
down with this smaller more defined brush and then go in with this brush to blend it out and I'll show you crazy a little bit and then I'm just gonna go slowly it doesn't have to be slowly but just gently softly blending just that shape that I did I'm going to go in with the cooler tone, this one right here, do the same thing. I'm going to go in with my bigger blending brush and just blend these edges so that's even seamless. Everything should be seamless for this look. Okay, so now I think I'm, I'm ready to apply the center lid color and I am, this eye, the color, um is still pretty much there but on the other side I'm gonna apply a little bit more because it got blended out a little bit more and I might go back and apply a little bit more here but just to the center kind of patting it on what I'm going to do is with my NYX matte um, finish makeup setting spray. I'm going to spray my brush and get it damp. Two sprays. I'm going to get it damp for this super shimmery color. And you can't really tell here, but this color is so shimmery. It almost looks like a pressed pigment. And that's the color I'm going to use for the center of my lid. And using a damp a damp brush versus a dry, it just makes it come out more vibrant, more pigmented. So <clears throat> I'm just going to pat that on to the center of my lid. Press it on. outwards I'm gonna go back in with the dark color just a little bit start there and then go in with the lighter color and just do some more blending
I'm gonna curl my lashes, put on mascara, and then put these fluffy lashes on. They look a little scary, but I'm putting these guys on, and then I will be back. Okay, so I have my lashes on, um, and these are my 3D Mink lashes, if you're interested. Um, they will be coming soon, but you can shop right here ninaceleste.com you can shop the lashes that I currently have available there right now um so I am going to do my brow bone highlight and then I'm going to move on to the rest of the face I'm going to use this cream color matte cream color and go like right where my arch is start there and then blend it out because that's where I want the most color start there and then blend it out and then I'm going to go in with that blending brush and just blend it out so it's softer That's kind of warming up my brow bone a little bit. And then I'm just kind of pressing it to tone it down. And that is the eye look for now. Just blending a little bit. That is the eye look for now. And I'm going to move on to the face. And then I'm just going to go in with a few colors on my bottom lash line and then we are done we are done honey okay so i'm just gonna start with the colors that i used in my crease and i'm just gonna put them at the bottom and i'll zoom in for that Classic Great Lash. My glow, honey. Now I'm going to do the lips. So I'm using two Georgiana. Georgiana. Georgiana! I'm using two Jordana lip pencils and then it's just an NYOX NYX lip butter gloss and I'm looking around because I can't find it so hold on I'm just going to use one of these today I don't know where it is Okay, so I'm using the Jordana lip liner in Coco Loco Uh, the center and I'm filling it in and this is called Rockin' Rockin' Rose okay L'Oreal Color Riche, and I have two of them, L'Oreal Color Riche and Midtown Hustle, I'm just put a center a little bit, the center. So 
I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Tag me if you try this look or tag me looks you want me to try to recreate. Um, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. That lip though. All natural.